Welcome to Paradise. This is the Beach House. You'll find that this location is unique. I mean, where do you find a place that is right on beautiful azure waters that serves wonderful native fresh seafood, great local produce, and a staff that can't wait to serve you? Our staff looks forward to creating great memories for our guests, and they do it on a nightly basis. And we've got a lot of great aspects of this property. Nightly entertainment that's fabulous. A great place for banquets and weddings and special events. Our chef and team here specialize in native fresh seafood and great local ingredients. So come join us at the Beach House. Take 20 minutes and feel like you're a thousand miles away. Relax in a wonderful environment on the sparkling waters of the Gulf of Mexico. Have a glass of Lola. It'll make your day. We're an independent restaurant. We're a unique restaurant, but in the whole corporate scheme of things, we're kind of a small guy. The Originals gives us power, power to bind together with other local independent restaurants. It's a pleasure and a privilege to be a part of the Sarasota Manatee Originals. Hi, my name is Will Manson. I'm the chef at the Beach House Restaurant, and welcome to my kitchen. Today, we're gonna to be preparing a potato encrusted grouper with a uh, dark rum and citrus glaze. Our first step is two ounces of clarified butter and add it to a, a very hot pan. Fresh baked potato, Idaho baked potato, and I have matchstick cut vegetables blended throughout. I have red bell pepper, celery, carrots, and onions, and also a little bit of scallion. We add our potatoes to the very hot pan and we spread the potatoes out. Then we take our grouper, we place it skin side up. You watch the potatoes as they cook and you set, wait to see them browning around the edges before you turn the fish in the pan. You could just take and touch the fish with your hand and turn, turn the dish just like so and then you get an idea that everything is coming together and that the potatoes will hold this dish together. It's time to, to flip our dish. It takes a little bit of practice but it's kind of fun once you learn how to do it. You could practice with eggs in a pan if you want to do it. So you just make sure that everything's loose in the pan and then you just give it a high flip in the pan just like so. Then we're gonna finish our fish in the oven at 500 degrees. Just pop the whole pan in the oven and bake it until it's done. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take a couple of ounces of dark rum and we're gonna flame off and burn the alcohol off the rum. Try not to catch yourself on fire. The alcohol should burn off rather quickly when your flame starts to diminish and the, and the alcohol reduces. Then we're gonna add two ounces of fish stock. We're gonna add about a tablespoon of horseradish, about three ounces of orange marmalade. We're gonna finish this ditch, dish with some matchstick cut vegetables. We're just gonna throw them in our sauce and wilt them down just a little bit. We wanna keep them a little bit crunchy. It gives a nice texture to the dish to finish it. And then we're gonna throw, put a little bit on top, some of our sauce around the dish. Finish it with a little chopped, fresh chopped scallion and a little parsley. Here we have the potato encrusted grouper with dark rum citrus glaze. And I want to thank you all for joining me at the Beach House Kitchen.